My name is Dan Perkins. I'm an Applications Engineer for Roden Schwartz America. I'm here at Mobile World Congress Americas uh, demonstrating our ATS-1000, which is uh, predominantly a uh, test system for testing uh, FR2 bands, a uh, millimeter wave. Uh, so today what I'm doing is I'm demonstrating um, our, our conical cut positioning system, um, taking spherical scans of a, uh, a omnidirectional antenna. Um, some of the key things about the ATS-1000 is the position accuracy. Uh, with millimeter wave, we have to deal with uh, phase array antennas, you know, 4x4 four four up to 256 element. Uh, with these phased arrays, when they grow uh, based on wavelength, we have to uh, measure at a higher angular resolution, which requires higher precision positioning. Uh, one of the key, com uh, key things about the ATS-1000 is the position accuracy is a 0 .03 degree accurate. Um, and, and again, it's uh, primarily used at the white box CPE testing or from the component level. So during the antenna scan, what we're using is we're using our vector network analyzer. Here we're capturing amplitude and phase over the phi and theta polarities, uh, basically capturing all the results in, in 3D within the chamber. Um, AMS32 is our control software. AMS32 is actually collecting these statistics. And what we can do with this information is, uh, in some cases, again, depending on the uh, number of elements in our phased array antenna, we may uh, be in the near field or we may be in the far field. In the case today, we're actually in the far field. And what I have is on the left panel, this is the raw results where I'm actually capturing 40 degree uh, angular resolution for azimuth and elevation. You can see on the, uh, on, on the uh, left side of the screen here, uh, this is the near field to far field transformation where I, I transform down to a one degree angular resolution. You can see that there's no difference in pattern, there's really no difference in directivity. This tells me for a fact that I'm in that far field condition, which is a half meter measurement distance within the ATS-1000.